بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم وی ہیو ہرڈ ڈاکٹر سلار احمد پریزنٹیشن آن ویری ٹو آن ٹو ویری سینسٹیو ایشوز دا پولیٹیکل سسٹم آف اسلام اینڈ دا اکنامک سسٹم آف اسلام دی ٹو ایریاز آر ویری سینسٹیو دی ون آف آس ہیز ہز اون سینسبلٹیز کمنگ فرام ڈفرینٹ کلچرز آف کورس ڈفرینٹ مائنڈ سیٹ وی مے ہیو ڈفرینٹ آئیڈیاز But Dr. Israr Ahmad is essentially representing Quran and Hadith. That is his normative point of view. Now for interaction, I would first request Dr. Norton. Um, I have listened attentively to what you've said, and I feel obligated as a proud Jew, let me say, who believes in Judaism, but perhaps even more importantly, as an open-minded and I hope compassionate human being, uh, and uh, who... Um, and as an advocate uh, of democracy, uh, I really feel that I must make a brief, respectful, but also frank comment that you may answer if you wish. Now, for much of my life in my teaching, writing, and human rights act activity, I have struggled against the Jewish exclusivity of the state of Israel, made so by its Zionist character. As a number of great Jewish thinkers have argued in the past, and do argue today, This exclusivity is in opposition to basic human values in Judaism. This state incorrectly presumes to speak for all the Jews of the world. This state is an exclusivist one because it grants rights and privileges by law to Jews, not granted to non-Jews. The state has also oppressed the indigenous Palestinian population in order, in order to maintain itself as a Zionist state. Here is the heart center of the Palestinian-Israeli conflict. As, I, as, I, as already stated, as I already stated, I have opposed and do oppose the exclusivist state of Israel just as I oppose other types of exclusivist states based upon race, color, and or religion. I have witnessed in the past decade especially growing numbers of Jews who, although still a minority, agree with the position that I have. This minority includes both religious and secular Jews. The religious Jews, by the way, believe that today the Torah is valid, alive, and is correctly the word of God, just as you believe the same for the Quran. They, by the way, would be surprised, as frankly was I, if they heard or read some of your interpretations of Judaism that they consider to be factually incorrect, such as your comments yesterday about uh, Torah following the destruction of the first temple in 586 before the Common Era, the meaning of the destruction of Sodom and Gomorrah, and your written comment in this pamphlet about Jews believing they are exempt from punishment by God on the Day of Judgment, which according to uh, Judaism, is not correct. The Jews, religious and secular, who believe, as do I, about exclusive estates, obviously reject your advocacy of an Islamic state in Israel or anywhere else in which non-Jews and others do not have all the same human rights, including all of the political rights, that includes the right to vote as well, as do Muslims. Those Jews who believe in Zionism and support the Jewish exclusive state, they also, of course, certainly reject your idea that could, if your advocacy prevails totally at any time in the future, could result uh, at some point in an Islamic state in all of historic Palestine, which encompasses the present state of Israel. Presently then, 5.2 million Jews reside in Israel. Not many, if any, Israeli Jews would accept your advocacy in an Islamic state. In the late 1970s, at a meeting in London, organized by the Organization of the Islamic Conference, to which I was invited as a panelist, I said this to the Palestinian Islamic theologian Ismail al-Faruqi, who advocated an Islamic state for the whole Middle East, including Palestine Israel. He answered that the only three choices for Jews in Palestine would be to leave, to accept the Islamic state, or to stay, fight, and then be expelled or killed. Now, before asking you to state if you would answer likewise, I wish to point out briefly, 
In addition, that an American scholar from Harvard, as you probably know, Samuel Huntington, espoused the theory a few years ago that there was a clash of civilizations between the West and Islam. Some other scholars agree with this theory. Some, like myself, argue that this theory is incorrect. Key advisors to President George W. Bush believe and advocate this theory. What you have said indicates to me that you believe this theory to be correct, even though you are on the Islamic side of the argument. If I am correct in my assumption, you are, I suggest, actually helping the advocacy of the Bush advisors, even though that is, of course, not your intent. Perhaps you would also comment upon this. Again, I make this uh, comment respectively, respectfully but sincerely. Yesterday, you advocated serious debate and dialogue with non-Muslims. I also make my brief comment in that context and with that spirit. Admittedly, I am ready to pursue further discussion, debate, and dialogue with you, although, given your belief that you have the truth from God through Muhammad, I certainly do not think that I can shake you even to question your faith. And I have doubts that you will be able to convince me to believe differently than I do. Perhaps then the discussion will be useful only to the extent that we make sure we understand one another's positions and views correctly. Thank you. I don't think I have to say anything about these comments except one. The alternatives for Jews or Christians or Hindus or Sikhs or in Islamic State, they are not only three that either they leave or they become Muslims or they fight. No. I told you they can remain in Islamic State, they can remain Jews, they can remain Christians, they can remain Sikhs, they can remain Hindus. But the overall political socio-economic system will be Islamic. But you have the right to believe anything, you have the right to, to worship anything in any way you like. You have the authority to practice your own personal law. I, I have told you. They could stay. Yes. That's definitely. one option. Definitely. So but, two others. but they are not equal citizens. May I? Have you? Yes, no? I'm Thank you. Uh, I, I, I think uh, I have a couple of observations, questions. 